This Honda element has given us a check engine light. And you may not know this, but if you go to most auto parts stores, they will read the check engine lights for free. The check engine light code that came up on this element was P0141. That basically means the second oxygen sensor is not working properly. It's not heating up as it should. Now there's a couple reasons for that. One is the electrical connector could be bad. There could be some corrosion there. But more likely, the actual sensor is bad. When buying a sensor, you always want to get a direct fit oxygen sensor, like this Bosch oxygen sensor. You never want to use a universal fit oxygen sensor if you can avoid it. To access the oxygen sensor, you'll jack up the driver's side of the vehicle, support it with the jack stand, and that will give you plenty of room to get to the sensor. The first oxygen sensor is here. The second oxygen sensor is here. This is the one we're going to be changing. The wiring connector for the sensor that we're going to change is here. There's a tab that you press down and then it slides off the connector. You do not need a special oxygen sensor tool to take this off. You can use a 22 millimeter wrench. To get a good bite on the sensor, we're gonna remove this shield, or actually we're just gonna take these two 10 millimeter screws off and bend the shield back. When loosening the sensor, it should come out fairly easily. Just give it a little tap. The new sensor should already come with some anti-seize compound on the threads. Be careful to get it straight in the hole. Just tighten it up slightly. You don't want to crank it down. And then plug it in. Put the shield back on. With the new oxygen sensor installed, the check engine light should clear automatically. If you'd like to speed up the process, you can disconnect the battery, let it sit for about 15 minutes, and then reconnect the battery, and that should clear the code for you.